James isn't a grower, he's a shower. Hey, I mean, yeah, that sounds about right. But if we're being honest with ourselves, if we're being really honest with ourselves, being a grower is better 100% of the time. Because, and I'll give you a reason, right? If, if, if it's small, when it's soft, right? You're like, oh, I'm flaccid. And it's like two and a half inches, right? You're like, oh, that's tiny. And a girl sees it. She's like, fuck me. That, that is an abomination. That's tiny. But then, you know, you cast your magic. You cast your enlargement charm. And boom, you got a strong five and a half inches, right? Strong, a strong five and a half inches, right? It's strong. You've added girth to it as well. She's going to think that's a lot bigger than it was before. And relatively speaking, it's going to look big, right? Just don't just don't ever stand next to someone that's you know, like 7 or 8 inches cuz then then it won't, that won't work. If you know, she was looking at something that's you know, it's like two and a half inches, like that's tiny, you know, it's tiny. You grow to a strong five and a half inches. That's going to to her, that's going to look like 7 inches. You're not going to be able to tell, because you're going to be like, that's so much bigger than it was before. By comparison, it's going to be big. It's like when you see a puppy. Okay, just hear me out first. You see a puppy, it's 8 weeks old, you can pick it up in one hand, right? You can hold it, you can pick it up in one hand, and it's just a tiny little puppy. You don't see it again for 6 months, it grows to like this size. It's big, it's bigger. They're like, whoa, you've grown, look how much he's grown, blow me, he's massive now, right? Compare that dog to a Great Dane. It's not. It's still a small dog. It's still a small dog, right? But compared to what it looked like as a puppy, you're like, whoa, they're so, it's so big, you know? What a big dog. And that applies to a penis too. So what I'm saying is, it's always better to be a grower than a shower. It's, it's always better. It's always better because if you're a shower, it just, you've got, you've, you've laid your cards out from, from the, from the first second, right? Because whether you're flaccid or not, that's it. That's all you've got, right? That's all you've got. So if you're, if you're still a strong five and a half inches, and I'm strong, it, it is strong. It's a strong five and a half inches, right? If you grow nothing at all when you get hard, it's just the same. It's exactly the same. So if she thinks it's below average at that point, doesn't matter how hard you get, you're still below average to her. You're not improving. But if you if you have a small penis and then it grows, she's gonna be like, wow, that's bigger. And it'll be impressive. So what I'm saying is, that is, that's better for you. There you go. Good, I'm glad we're all in agreement. <coughs> Cockology class. 